Let me tell you something. God bring people in your life for a reason, a season, or maybe even a lifetime. Right now, some people in your life right now that you fighting to keep in your life. They ain't fighting for you. They fighting against you, but you so goddamn blind. You trying to keep them in your life, and that's just God trying to tell you, let them go, because I done did my purpose with them in your life. But you just want to hold on to them. See, everybody ain't able to sit at your table. And see, what God got for you, he got for you. Everybody else can't come for your blessing. Everybody else can't be around for your blessing. That's your blessing. So you got to let God shape you up for the blessing. Because see, the blessing already prepared for you. But you just won't let go for your old habits and your old friends. And you keep talking about, that's family. That's my cousin. That's my sister. Yeah, them be the ones that's toxic to you. Them be the ones that know so much about you. And they hating so bad. They so jealous. They in competition with you. And you so damn crazy that you want to fight against God when God says, son, daughter, niece, cousin, auntie, I done did my purpose with these people. You got to let them go because I got something bigger in store for you. People come in your life for a reason, a season, or maybe a lifetime. But we can count on our toes how many people in our life right now for a lifetime. Because we ain't friends with the same people we went to high school with. We ain't friends with the same people we went to college with or we used to work with or we was in jail with. They just passed through our life to get us through a tough time. They just passed us through, through our life to get us through something. See, God used people in your life for a reason, and you got to let that manifest. You can't fight against God's power, because you ain't never going to win that battle. Yeah, everybody ain't able to sit at your table. Understand that. You destined for greatness, but you keep fighting against your greatness, trying to go back to your past. Stop going backwards. Ain't nothing back there. Ain't nothing in that rearview mirror. Ain't nothing. Everything in front of you. Go get your blessings. Go get your blessing, man. Don't let nobody talk you out your dream. Everybody ain't able to sit at your table. The people you start with, you ain't gonna finish with. They just here for a reason. God just might just be opening a door for, for you through them. Let them do that. But then remove them people. Because they not right. They not logic. They not knowledgeable. They don't have a good heart. They ain't pure. Understand that. Let God do his job. Stop fighting against that. Man, that's my cousin. Man, that's my brother. Man, I'm a real nigga. Yeah, you real dumb. Because he keeps showing you. They keep backstabbing you. They keep crossing you. You still got him in your life. You not following the signs. Pay attention to the signs. That's why your blessing ain't manifest yet. Because you know why? The blessing already there. He just molding you. You a mold. Are you clay. He's shaping you up for your blessing. The food already on the table. You just got to find the right table. And everybody ain't able to sit at your table. We the business.